Vlogmas day nine. Y'all, I can't believe I'm doing this. Like, I thought I was going to like skip some days, but y'all, I'm on point. So, today is going to be another wig review. I know, I know. But like, y'all know I don't be doing nothing. Like, my vlogs be boring. So, but I do have content for you guys. So, this video is sponsored by Extra and Hair. I have worked with them in previous videos before. So, they sent me a wig to review. Also, real quick, these nails are still holding up great. I just want y'all to know that that little press-on gel kit is like my new go-to. I'm never going back to a nail salon. And, um, yeah, I've cornrowed my hair with this. Like, I was doing laundry. Like, just do multiple coats. Like, I feel like I just don't understand people are saying, oh, my nails broke off. And I'm just like, nothing. But anyways, so... Extreme sent me this hair to or this wig, sorry, to review as well as some wig caps. Now this comes in a pack of five. Um, or they're actually mesh spandex dome caps. So you guys know I wear a lot of wigs and I make wigs as well. So I literally have enough to last me for my next five installs. So I'm happy about that. I'll have a link for this below. It was super cheap and affordable. I think it's like $5 for five of those. And then, which you would probably pay $5 for one of those at your beauty spot store. And they sent me this wig, guys. This wig is 40 inches. Y'all know I'm short. Like, so in the bag, <laughs> in the bag comes your wig, and the little fish, not fish net, lunch lady net. And then you also get a wig cap, and this is brown. So I'm not gonna use it today, but yeah, that's good to have. And yeah, so this is the wig. It is a wavy wig. Y'all, this hair is super long. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to readjust the camera. So that you guys can see how long it is on me. But basically, this is the construction of it. There's three combs in it and the adjustable straps, which I'm going to go ahead and hook those now. Because I hate when those be hanging out my wigs. I think something's crawling on my neck. So let me go ahead and hook these. I never really use them anyway, but let's go ahead and do this like this. Okay, so this is the wig. Y'all, look at that hairline. Oh, not the hairline, the part. I'm sorry, guys. Can you see it? I don't know. Maybe it looks better my way. Oh, it definitely looked better when it was not. Anyway, we're going to pluck it and see, but this is it. This is the 40-inch wig. It's super wavy and beautiful. Beautiful. And um, I'm trying to think how much this was. I really think it's like under $40, if I'm not mistaken. So I'm going to put the wig on. Y'all, this is a lot of hair. Oh, guys, it is so soft and pretty. But I look like Chewbacca. Um, so, if I ever wear this wig out, I'm going to tell you guys right now, definitely going to cut it. But it's so pretty, guys. Like, oh my gosh. Okay, so what I'm about to do real quick is I'm going to, um, Readjust the camera so y'all can see how long this wig really is on me. Y'all are about to laugh. Okay, y'all ready to laugh? Y'all look at this wig. Do y'all see? You still can't even get it all in the frame. Like, what did you think I was going with this long ass wig? It's so funny. I was watching Glamour's on tape. She had a 40 inch wig and I remember thinking to myself, that wig was thin. And... It didn't even look that hot on her. I mean, yeah, I, look, I mean, she's beautiful, so everything looks good on her. But I really wasn't even impressed on her. And they're going to see, oh, girl, it's stuck to my lip gloss. Okay, so let me show y'all how I finesse this wig. And then I'm probably going to show you how I cut this wig. Okay, so now that the wig is on, 
Lord Jesus, this is a lot of hair. It's a lot of hair. And it's thick. It's not like, it's not thin. It's thick. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so now I'm going to cut the lace. I wish I had, um, got some big glued um, hairspray. So that I could probably spray it first. But I don't. This is just a lot of hair. I'm like so tired. I'm tired. Um, let me do this again. Actually, do I really care? No. The lace blends in with my skin perfectly fine. So. I'm not really worried. I'm trying to debate on if I want to actually glue it down. I don't really see the point. But yeah. Okay, so now I'm going to go in and pluck some. Because this part could be wider. Is the part getting wider to y'all? Because... Baby. Actually, let me part, part, do it off camera and I'm going to come back. Okay, so the part looks a little better. Not ex like extremely better, but I kind of don't want to over pluck it just in case I decide to sell this wig. Um, Y'all let me know because I have a lot of wigs that I get sent. And most of them are synthetic, so I usually review them. I may wear them like a week, maybe, and then I don't really wear them anymore. So I might sell this wig. That's why I kind of, now that I think about it, I might not cut it because whoever I sell it to might actually want the 40 inches. So I don't know. I guess we'll see. But I'm going to try to do some baby hairs. I don't know. Let's see. Um, like I said, I don't want to pluck too much. I want to, because I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to wear this out. If I wear this out and about, like, I would literally have to um, cut it because this is too long. Okay, so I just took some mousse. And I cut a little bit. Y'all know I do my little swoop, which is so funny because I've noticed that, like, now I do it, like, with my real hair. And I ain't even got no, like, widow's peak. Like, is that what we're swooping, guys? Like, a widow's peak? I feel like that's what we be swooping. But see, like, for some reason, they just make the hair look ten times better to me. Or it's 10 times more natural. I don't know. I could be bugging. Um, I'm trying to see if I want to do some on the sides. Because I feel like it'll uh, make the wig look more natural. So, let's see. Uh, this doesn't want to stay. And I don't want to put glue or gel on it. Because, like I said, I'm probably going to sell this. Okay, I'm going to put it on the actual toothbrush and see if that helps. Okay, so now I'm going to do this side over here. Oh, God. I really don't want a lot of hairs out. But I feel like this is too much. But at the same time, oh well. Okay, let's see if I can push these down.
These are kind of stubborn. Girl, they did absolutely nothing. Okay. I think I'm going to have to use some gel. So let me get my gel. So I'm going to take some wet line gel and dip it in there. I'm going to see if this works. There we go. That looks... Girl, I don't know what this looks like. Does that look, oh, it do look kind of cuter. Okay, let me do the other side. Let's see. Okay, and then we're gonna dip it. Okay, um, I'm over it. <laughs> I'm so over it. Like, it don't even really, it don't matter. Okay, cool. It don't look bad. Um, I'm gonna cut this though, because it don't want to stay anyway. I'm gonna put a little, bit, a little bit more gel. There we go. And then, this is actually my baby hairs, so I'm just gonna brush them, and maybe that'll go in with the wig. Cool, sweet, tight. Okay, this is the wig. Super cute, super long. Um, let me see. It doesn't tangle. I mean, a little bit. It's a little snag here and there, but I mean, it's long, curly, synthetic hair. It is layered. Um, it does shed. However, I don't know if it's shedding because I put. No, nah, it just sheds. This is a lot. Can y'all see that? Yeah, y'all see that. Um, but I mean, it's curly and synthetic. Like, what did y'all expect? Um, but now that I have it on, y'all, I'm not gonna lie. I kind of like it. And I think I'm gonna cut it. I'm gonna take some pictures, though. So y'all gonna see the pictures in the uh, thumbnail. But I'm gonna cut this wig. And I think I'm gonna keep it. Because I like it. Even if I do like a short little bob, curly bob, that'd be cute. But I'm thinking I'm going to cut it like below my boob. And this is kind of cute. But yeah, this is what the hair looks like. All I have to the back. Hopefully it's not tangled and embarrassing me. I want to thank you guys for watching. Make sure you check out this wig. Make sure you buy it. Um, I didn't use any glue. And it, it's laying perfectly fine and flat. The lace was like a dark brown. So you don't really have to tint it if you're my color. Um... It's pretty. I like it. I feel like um, real from Chance and Real off of I Love New York when he used to have like have his hair. Oh, rest in peace, for real. Um, but yeah, I want to thank you guys for watching, and until next time, bye guys.